Welcome to 5 and 5, where we talk about five topics in five minutes, and I'm Josh Hamilton. I'm Serena Cheatley. So, Chad Ojosenko has joined the Patriots. I'm so excited. So excited. That is my team, and he's an awesome player, but he is willing to pay anything to get his number 85. Which from, you should, because... From from Aaron Hernandez. He changed his name to Ocho Cinco, which is a completely normal thing to do. I know, but just because you change your name doesn't mean you can get the number. I mean, Aaron Hernandez did really well last year with that number. Like, I, I really maybe, don't think it's a lucky number. It might be a lucky number, though. You never know. Like, If he sucks next year and gets traded, he's going to blame it on that number, giving up the number and stuff. So... Who knows? But is he? I don't even know if this guy's good or not. So like. Well, that's because you don't watch football and you're not a Patriots fan, so you wouldn't know that. Very true. <laughs> um, so in other news that I know, which is worse because she knows more sports than I do, in tech news, which I have someone about, new iPhone five rumors because it's you know that time again where iPhone rumors fill the internet. Um, a new photo has leaked from the China manufacturer because everything comes from China. Yeah, that's true. Um, with a new design, it's going to have a curved panel, looks like, um, a hole in the back where the Apple logo is, and where the like, Nintendo will be, and a larger but display. They're not sure. They're right? not sure. If it, they're not, you guys know, everyone knows out there that they're never it's sure. All so speculation. All speculation. It's like a prototype until you, design. Yeah, until um, you see the real thing. It is rumored to be released in September, so I guess we'll know until then because, you know, the Apple whole headquarters has everything on, like, you know, lockdown, but just like lockdown last year when the iPhone 4 got left in a bar. <laughs> so, That's but so funny. I will post the link down below so you guys can go check out the, the photo that I'm talking about that was leaked, and you can be the judge yourselves if it's a new iPhone or not. Yeah. So, our next story is um, Meatloaf. I hate Meatloaf, the food. <laughs> Meatloaf the singer fainted in a concert the other night in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Now, I've seen his music videos and concerts. My dad was a huge Meatloaf fan. I've seen it all. And, like, when he puts on a show, he puts on a show. And this was back in, like, the early 90s. He freaking wears these shirts, and he sweats all over the place. Well, he fainted. He had his asthma. But I think he fainted. Because of his tad eating problem of overweightness. Well, he's, and he's always old. been overweight, though. And he's old. He's old. I know. It's time for him to hang it up. No. Yeah. If Matt and Mick Jagger can still yeah, do it. Yeah, they should all hang up. Meatloaf can still do it. They should all hang it up. They should not hang it up. Journey was just on the Today Show. So, like, why, does, why is Journey on the... Because, they all should be done. Because everyone still likes Journey. But they're old. They're... But they're still going. Just, just like I don't, I'd just like my mom's see, meatloaf. I'd rather see fridge. a meatloaf no concert sense. than a Nickelback concert. So, what does that say about our generation of music? <laughs> I don't. know. <laughs> Speaking of our generation of music, <laughs> yeah, exactly. Soldier Here we Boy, go. Soldier Boy, drops fifty-five million dollars on that jet. Real quick, the run through is the jet cost thirty-five million. He put twenty million dollars in it to renovate leather seats, flat screen TVs, four liquor bars, uh, tile for Brazilian hardware floor, hardware cabinets. And a luxurious bathroom. He completely gutted out the bathroom and put a luxurious How does he even have that much money? Because he had, like, one you, hit. That's so stupid. Because of that song. That song, every time it gets played anywhere. I like to play that song on on the Dance Central, but I'm saying that and was... every time you play it on Dance Central, it's money in the bank. That's so dumb, though. Like, he's know. so dumb. And he's 21. He just turned 21. Yeah. I didn't know that. I thought he was, like, 25 or something. No, he is uh, not. So gross. yes, he is. It's not that smart. I he's he's gonna be yeah, so well, broke. Yeah, that's a waste of money. And good luck with that, soldier boy. So Apple is richer than our government. How about them apples? <laughs> <laughs> it's so corny. <laughs> but anyways, um, the government has about seventy three point eight billion dollars. Well, Apple has amazing seventy six point two billion dollars, which is only gonna Crazy. get more when that new iPhone comes out. Yes, and it's even more because the whole thing of it is is that Apple takes in more money than it spends, whereas our government spends more money than it takes yeah, in. Yeah, our government still hasn't figured that so one out. So we're going right? to default on loans, Apple is just going to be raking in money and going to be like a new money leader as opposed to our government. Maybe they can lend our government some money. Yeah. <laughs> I wouldn't. I think, I, think that, I think that might be a bad investment. Yeah, I think so too. So... You can be the judge of that, but thanks for watching 5 and 5, and please do not forget to subscribe up top. And, and like...